Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So we have got some super exciting news from Angular that they have released their version 19. So this latest version is packed with the feature that will really help us to improve our developer experience and it will make things better and better over the time. So there are a lot of things which has been changed and you want to know more about that. So you can head over to this blog.angular.dev where Minko has published a blog like what they have introduced in Angular version 19. And one thing which was really exciting for me to see is that they have clearly mentioned that this is built for speed, which I will really agree to him, right? So going forward, if you see, there are something which, uh, which has been done on the server side where they have a incremental hydration, which is in developer preview. If I go below, then there is something which is done on the routing level as well, where they have the new route level render mode. Then if I scroll, scroll down, I can see there are developer experience. We have HMR now enabled, which means that whatever changes you do on your template, you can see them live gets reflected so you don't have to refresh your page to see the changes right going forward so they have something done to the standalone which is default to true right we have strict standalone enforcement which is also good then if i scroll down we have evolving reactivity which means now we have all this migration command where we can move away from the decorator based things like for example input output view child view children so we don't have to use those decorator anymore going forward with angular version 19 because they have marked all those features as stable so and they have also provided a command by which once you run it so what it will do it will convert all your existing code which are decorator based with this new signals right and what i can also see they have modernized your code with okay so now we have some updates in the language service as well like if you have your existing code which are using decorator based so that you can go and really convert it by doing this quick fix which is really good going forward the feature which i was actually waiting for which is linked signal which they have introduced and i will be talking about it in detail right so we have this linked signal then there is something called as a resource api which is really good we have the state of effect api that's also nice then some advancement done in the angular material side and the cdk we have the new theming apis and the list is just not stopping man that they have introduced a lot of things so this is what has uh, inspired me to like let's go ahead and create a new video series where i will be talking about all this new advancement what angular has provided to us from version 16 to version 19. It's becoming increasingly important for us to explore and learn these new features which is shipped by Angular because looking at how they are moving towards the provide experimental zone-less model which really tells that they are planning to remove this zone.js to aim for some more performance gain in Angular. If you have noticed they are heavily focusing on enhancing the reactivity by introducing this linked signal and resource API which really brings the incredible capabilities to the signal. And speaking of going zoneless so let me introduce you to this my website which is let'sprogram.in this is a blog website which is completely zoneless and this is possible because I have upgraded this blog website over the time when we have introduced signal in version 16 and now which is we are having version 19 and I have used all the new features what they have shipped like linked signal and those resource API and also the pre-rendering the server side rendering and the client side rendering so I'm using all of those capabilities in this particular blog website which has really added this performance gain and if you can see that performance gain by going on this website and you can check the lighthouse score for it where i got completely 100 100 100 for all four categories so i highly recommend them diving into these new features and using them into your project wherever possible because they offer not only performance benefit but also they improve the way you code as i mentioned earlier that i'm working on a video series where i'm going to cover all of these new features and how i was able to achieve this zoneless experience from my blog website so this is going to be a step-by-step -step video so that you are not missing any part for example I, I just cannot just go directly and teach you guys what is linked signal and what is resource api and what are those what are those actually doing so the correct step would be that you first need the understanding of signals so that's what i'm going to do in the next video where i will be talking about what are signals 
and based on that knowledge i will be talking about this new features what they have introduced like now we don't used to use the decorator based input and all of those then we have this linked signal and then we have this resource api and all that okay so that's my plan for the upcoming videos over this channel so if you want to get notified for, for those new upcoming videos then i will highly recommend you to subscribe to my channel give it a thumbs up for this video if you liked what i have talked today and also consider sharing it with your friends because i am going to teach you something really interesting and something which will really stuck in your mind because of the way i am going to teach you because whenever i try to teach someone so i try to make a real life application as well so that also is in progress so i will be coming up with a real time application which will be leveraging all these new features so that you are not just learning but you are also doing a practical with me so thanks for watching this video guys see you guys in the next video where we will see the capabilities of this new signals See you guys. Bye-bye.